So what's going on everybody? Doing a quick video here of uh, some things that uh, we're currently doing a little bit differently. Um, there was a video made back a while back there where I uh, kind of recommended people going to get these. Um, yeah, I, I took a lot of blowback because people are dumbasses and want to go buy the book. Um, used to doing what people tell them. Um, I ran radios months without any issues, but to everybody, oh, you're going to blow the finals, you're going to blow the finals. And, and apparently they didn't actually watch the video and listen to the video because the video says even if the finals blow, it still will be good for around the house use, which is really what this thing is made for. Um... But I like to leave the door open for people to explore and and, and uh, be able to. That's kind of loud. Culver Fire Department, zero five three twenty three. Have a fire alarm called in by the alarm company at Walmart. Give me a zero second. Drive, coming from a pole station, zone thirty five. Somebody pulled the Walmart smoke company. detector with the fire alarm. All right, so anyways, um, so a lot of people gave me a lot of shit in that video, and I, I've dealt with enough bullshit from people from even when I first started. But I started looking around. These things are, are fairly cheap. They're, they're, I think they're $3 a piece. Uh, $3 a piece for this particular adapter. Um, total, people totally misread that video. I was trying to tell them, this antenna that comes with these radios are junk. They are cheap particularly just trash they're pointless um you get yourself an aftermarket antenna and you probably do a hell of a lot better um even being connected right to it but anyways what i decided to do um was started purchasing these cables these are three bucks um and uh they will come with either this type or it will run up to this uh, that it'll be a cable that would run to the, uh, SO or PL, whatever the fuck they want to call this nowadays. The CB connector is what I like to call it. We're turning into a CB network, so we might as well call it a damn CB connector. Alright, so anyways, uh, we'll have, on the website we'll be updated once these come in. Uh, and the prices will be a little bit higher because of fancy stuff that people want added to the shit. Uh, if you don't want any of this there will be an option for that at our flat rate of 155 uh if you want this uh particular this particular that goes to the sma uh female um it would be 157 dollars and i think for the one that pids tails up to this i think is four dollars so it would be a hundred well seven eight so sorry 108 dollar or 58 dollars for for this particular one and for this one, uh, I think it would be like 159, 160, something like that. So uh, the the website will be updated accordingly for that. Uh, we are trying to uh, work hard on getting the basics of this stuff together um, and get a little bit of an inventory going before we open up the list. Um, I have told a lot of people in the past, um, that have asked if the list is uh, open, uh, to be paying attention to our YouTube videos or Facebook or website. I think I'm just going to wind up recontacting them again, um, and actually reaching out to them versus, uh, trying to keep a waiting list because it seems like it never fails. Either the person gets up the nerve and tries to do it themselves, which I am okay with, or uh, they just lose interest. It seems like it's a knee-jerk thing. Um, but anyways, yeah, it's uh, coming together. I think this is the final build here that looks just kind of nice. Um, the antenna extrudes from the top of it there. And, and when it's closed, it really looks like just a, a radio box. Uh, it's a big box. That's all it is there. So... All right, thanks for watching GMRS.network. If you haven't checked it out, uh, watch more of the videos on here and our Facebook group, the GMRS Linked Network. There it goes again.